Hey y'all, Sheree here with Not Sure What's Cooking. Well, I am going to be doing an experimental recipe, okay? And I call it Shrimp Dogs. All right, let's get started here. Get you two green onions and wash those little babies really good and cut off the bad part on the ends. And get you two red bell peppers, these kind like this. It kind of looks like a jalapeno pepper, don't it? But anyway, go ahead and cut them up like this. In the meanwhile, go ahead and preheat your oven to 400 degrees. Get you a pan and line it with foil. Then get you some brats, the cheddar and bacon ones. Those are so good. Let me know in the comments below if you think the cheddar and the bacon ones are the best ones. Or let me know which ones you like the best. All right, so go ahead and line the pan up. And we're going to put it in the oven, I don't know, for maybe 15 minutes or so. All right, y'all, follow along with me and let's see how this actually really turns out. All right, after you get those onions and peppers cut up, put it in a small skillet there. Then get you some small shrimp, some extra small ones. You're gonna only be using a half a bag. Go ahead and throw those little babies in there. And you're not gonna put anything in here except the shrimp and those onions. All right, now stick along, stay on. All right, keep. All right, stick with me, cause we're gonna see how this goes. All right, turn your fire on medium and just kinda like saute them, but you're not gonna use butter. So it'll be a little bit more healthier, I guess. Look how pretty and festive that looks. Oh my gosh, this would be great for Christmas because it's got the red and the greens in it. Absolutely beautiful right there. What do y'all think? Y'all think that's some pretty colors in there? All right, y'all, see all that water in there that came from the shrimp? So I turned the, um, the fire up even higher to Get those little babies going, because I want this done quick. All right, so turn it up higher and just make sure that you stay around it. You know, like I said, this is an experiment, so hopefully, hopefully it'll turn out good. I think it will. But anyway, stick with me here. Take those little babies out after about 15 minutes and turn them over. Now we're going to put them back in the oven for about five minutes. Now, always make sure your dogs are done, your brats, whatever you want to call them. Make sure they're done. My oven cooks a little bit faster, so hopefully mine will be done. We'll see. All right, now we're going to take one of these after taking them out of the oven here. Of course, I guess you know that, that I took them out. And we're going to cut it and show you how. We take it and cut it like this. And you see, you're going to cut it almost completely in two. All right? Now, we're going to take that shrimp, that festive-looking shrimp. What do y'all think? That stuff is good. Looks good, and it tastes good. All right, now what you're going to do is put them on some Hawaiian buns and then start stuffing that where you cut it with all that. Look how pretty that looks. Y'all think that looks pretty? You think you would eat it? Would y'all eat this? All right, now get you some chow chow. I've got the mild, but... Um, you know, you can use the mild or the hot and go ahead and sprinkle some of that on there on the side. 
I'll get, now I'll get you some mustard, good old mustard. Yum, yum. And just, just barely put it on there. I mean, this is really to your taste. So you just do whatever, how much you want on there. Look at there. Yummy. All right, y'all. I added some kale salad, cranberry kale salad, to make it a little bit healthier. Um, but anyway, I mean, you can have chips with it or whatever. This is just what I want. Now, I am going to take a bite and let you know how it tastes because I am hungry, hungry. Mmm. Oh my goodness. Y'all have got to try this. This would be great for any time, really. I mean, oh my gosh. The combination of the cheddar brocks, the shrimp, everything. Oh wow. It's just it I I know I'm kind of going crazy here, but I'm going to tell y'all, this is amazing. All right, so I think I'm going to call this Fiesta Shrimp Dogs instead of Shrimp Dogs because it is a fiesta in your mouth. All right, well, hey, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And, and just remember, if you believe it, you can make this. So simple, and I really believe that your family is going to really love this. And until next time, be blessed and safe, y'all. Bye!